Hello, Internet. Welcome back to Morrowind. <laughs> this time, I finally remembered. Now, let's see. To change the audio settings before starting recording. Let's see, I still need to pick those up and sell them at some point, though. How to do this, I do not quite know yet. Um, well, ideally, dropping something and picking it up later. Well, I could pro I could probably just pull that off. Pretty carved ebony dart. Oh yeah, that's the two thousand gold dart. Woo! Man, it's amazing how, many, how uh, valuable some of these some of the, some of these things are. I don't want to drop anything that's... Uh, oh, eh, whatever. It's fine, it'll stay keybound. Yep. So let's just pick all this Dark Brotherhood crap up. Get loads of money for it. Then come back for the uh, other stuff. Come on. Daedric Wakisashi. 48,000 gold. I'm... I'm keeping that. That's... I'm keeping that. No doubt in my mind. Oh, also I should mention that the frame rate in all these Morrowind bed... Bleh, Morrowind videos should be significantly better than they ever were. I've enabled V-Sync, triple buffering, and threaded optimization in the NVIDIA control panel, so... <laughs> if it goes below 30 at any point, I'm going to be surprised. And let's... barter with uh, this guy. Kinda hidden, kinda sorta hidden at least. Sell all this crap. 3060. I wonder if you can just press sell or max and succeed. I should have tried that. Oh well. Now to just head back to Shank's shovel. Not the trader. Yeah, here. Get my stuff from upstairs and. Well, I may, I mean, I may need to cast Recall to get back to Balmora if I remember. I think that's where I'm going anyway, or where the uh, mark is set. Oh yeah, I'll have to do that. I am taking this. I'm keeping it in my personal collection. I can't remember if there was anything I was going to do in Caldera, but whatever. Welcome, friend. You're nearly a legend around here. Please, talk. Ah, the Mage's Guild. I should really mark, or set the mark in uh, Caius's house. I'll feed a Torgo Feather, that's what I'm thinking of. 43% chance of cast. That's unfortunate. I really need to improve that alteration. Do you train alteration? Yes, you do. How convenient. Just bump that up to like 20 or something. What's the chance now? 56? All right. What? Didn't I just cast Feather? 20 points. Even then, even that's not enough. Shit. This is a bit of a problem. Well, this isn't owned by anybody, so I can just always come back and take it. Technically, it was owned by somebody, but they're kind of dead, so they can't really care, can they? No, they can't. This is probably not the best path. Actually, this is probably the worst path to take because it's not very efficient. Speak up. No, 
I'm carrying things. Okay, and once I get this taken care of... I said once I get this taken care of, I can go back in my uh, crossbow and then get on with actually doing something useful instead of just greedily hoarding all the valuable stuff. And I need to drink a potion. I can make it. Okay, I can make it. Oop. As long as they don't walk into a wall. Gaius, something new for you. Uh, the, the, the Daedric Wakisashi. A bunch of... I gotta get around to reading those books as well. Um, are there any alteration, other alteration spells I can cast? Or is that the only one? No, there's Levitate. But that costs far too much magicka. I guess I'll just keep casting Feather. Simply for the sake of leveling up alteration. Why does this draw distance seem so terrible? Because it is! What the hell? Time Shadows... I th won't touch that because I think I've got a custom setting in the INI. I'll turn this back down a bit because it dropped the frame rate down to about 20. Well, no, I don't want to start a new game. Okay. Let me take this. Thank you. Nothing new. So, what was I working on? Okay, I've already finished that Delirious Varro quest. No, I will not be doing something about... Uh, Expansion packs at this point. Got the main game to worry about. Fuel the outlaw. Why is that a quest? I killed him. Okay, for the love of a Bosmer. I'm guessing I need to like check back on him at some point. Otherwise, that shouldn't really be a, a quest. Some House Redoran quests, despite really pissing them off in a Haldrun. Kill Necromancer Tashpi Ashbil. Well, that sounds interesting. Margon. Conveniently, now that I remember, Margon is a place I need to go for the main quest as well, so kill two birds with one stone. <laughs> Yep, that was just at Caius' house, and I forgot to leave two of my other fancy, expensive thingamabobbers there. Oh, curiosity. No, I, I must have just leveled up, so... Okay. At least another potion. What's with all these cheap potions? Personality is only 63, and it seems like pretty much everybody in the game likes me. Not bad, not bad. Uh, Mark, All right. Let's just let. Uh... God, look at all this stuff. Make sure 
sure I'm picking up the darts and not the uh, moon sugar. Okay. First try. No. Second try. Yes! And now I can probably take this torch. That's right, I was going to use the marksman weapons more often because I need to uh, level up marksman a little more than I need to level up long blade. Of course I need to level up the magic skills even more than that, but... Well, you know, marksman weapons you don't need to buy or find expensive restored magicka potions for. And you don't need to abuse the uh, sleep anywhere feature to uh, restore arrows. Okay. Guess we'll just take the silt strider up, uh, up that we way. Fortunately, you are not falling off the roof yet. And you shall take me to Aldrun. I should go to Saran at some point. Vivek as well, because I've still got that one Fighter's Guild quest over in that area. That reminds me, I don't seem to have done a whole lot for the Fighter's Guild. Then again, I haven't really felt like doing it since one of those quests is undoable. Well, kind of, sort of undoable. Simply because it interferes with the Thieves' Guild, and I don't really want to you know, ruin, sully my reputation with the Thieves' Guild. I've been to Margan uh, manually before, so I might as well just, you know, kind of fast travel there. Ten gold. We make a special trip just for Say So, who is this necromancer? Ashbi Ashibel. Wait, I sh should probably look at the name. No, nothing new. Ah, well, the uh, Silt Strider rides restored my magicka, so I can cast spells again. That's good. Outpost, probably not in there. I'm a sleeper, one among thousands. I've already spoken to you people. Leave me alone, you damn cultists. And you as well? You may speak. Oh, you're just a regular guy. Okay. I don't believe I've seen an Imperial with such a grand outfit in some time. Can I help you? Um, necromancy, what can you tell me about it? Tashpi is not a necromancer. Who have you been talking to? I didn't mention Tashpi. You just made me suspicious of you. I'm watching you, scum. Tashpi, 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 where the hell are you? Ah, there you are. Well, presumably, anyway, it's your house, at least. Ah, perhaps I can steal something valuable while I'm here. Outlander, what do you want? Should start saving. Don't need to lose any progress. Welcome to Margan, Zeros. I'm Tashbi Ashbea. Ashiba. Margan is the site of the Holy Tower Shrine, favorite place of pilgrimage for the Temple of Faithful. Can I help you find someone in particular? Well, I suppose I can ask you about Bed and Gilladren, for some reason. A missing pilgrim. Trallus Rendus is at the shrine right... Bleh. Trallus Rendus... Trallus Rendus at the shrine might know something about it. How about some rumors? Some Ashlanders nearby have been bragging about how they captured a famous noble. I wonder who it is. Ah. That must be the person I saved. And then killed. <laughs> Are you interested in the healer's trade in Morrowind? Maybe you should talk to e talk with Igfa at Port Pelagiad in the Pelagiad village. 
She's very nice, experienced, and very patient with questions. Perhaps I could use somebody like that in Oblivion as well, you know, considering I've got really terrible healing spells and nobody sells any. Um, secrets. Secrets, secrets. If someone attacks you first, you have the right to defend yourself. If someone doesn't attack you first, you're going to break the law if you attack him. Or her, I guess. Margon is a Redoran egg mining village in the northern Ashlands. So, north of Aldrun. Okay, I've been putting the apostrophe in the wrong place in the uh, video descriptions. Damn. Close to Foyada Banidad, the ghost fence on the plains beneath the Red Mountain. The mountain monsters have been breaking through the ghost fence here and attacking the villagers. Fortunately, monster fighters have answered the call for volunteers to come protect come help protect Margon. Pilgrims of the Tribunal Temple come to visit the Margon Tower shrine where Lord Vivek outwitted the bad danger Lord Merunus Dagon. Anything about lore? <coughs> Imperials worship powerful spirits. But are they the right spirits? They are powerful, but are they good? We used to worship the Daedra, but now we worship the true gods, the Tribunal. And the Daedra serve the true gods in fear and humility. I'm not so sure about that. What about a trade? I am a healer. I have sworn Solomos to the, in the College of Restoration to heal the afflicted and cure the diseased. But if, I have also learned that preventing harm... Oh, why did I hit the console button? Ah. Preventing harm to others often requires a more active opposition to monsters and malefactors. So I have studied both the unarmed, unarmored... I think I've read this before. Somebody else said it. What about your tr... I just asked that. Necromancy. Necromancy? I am not a necromancer. Who said I was a... a necromancer? Ranisathris, of course. Oh, I see. I refuse to join the Mages Guild. I chose to practice healing among my people, away from the politics of the Guild. Since I was a Velothi, and not well born like Rannis. Well, it's not important now. Maybe I know a way out of this situation. Tell me more. <laughs> if Rannis was, has held a grudge this long, it would not be. It would be best for me to leave the, to, to leave for the mainland. There are plenty of towns that could use a healer. Tell Rannis after that I am dead. I will leave Vardenfell and Rannis need never know. Well, I've been lied to by my guild leader, apparently. So... You may be on your way. I'll leave for the mainland as soon as I get a few things together. There are many other towns in need of a healer. Tell Rannis after that I am dead. Not big surprise. Oh. Hmm. Homilies of Blessed Amalexia, Anticipations in the Pilgrim's Path. Your books are not interesting. Well, so much for assassinations. Not a big fan of being lied to by the guild leader out of a uh, grudge. She's a Dunmer anyway. Possibly, you know, it's possible that she's not an outlander, so why would it be an issue if she's an, a necromancer? As far as I can tell in this game, the only people that really have, the only time necromancy is really considered a problem is when an outlander does it. So, I'm really not getting the issue. Okay, I need to leave this town. Unless there are some shops nearby, which... I'm not, I'm not really sure if I actually need any supplies. Uh, yeah, there is a trade house right in this direction, so I might as well stop by and have a look. Beneath the Red Mountain, Lord Dagoth sleeps, but when he wakes, we shall all rise and the dust will blow away. Serve your Lord Dagother, the sixth house is ridden and go away. Go! Ah. Damn cultists. Hmm. 
Ah, oh, you're a trainer in stuff that I don't really need to train in. However, I can ask, or yeah, ask you about the Urshulaku camp. Urshulaku camp is due north from Margon, but high ridges lie in the way. From Margon, head east past the Silt Strider, then take a trail north to the Foyada Banidad. Follow the Foyada northwest to the sea. A shipwreck at the sea mouth of the ravine is a landmark. Swim east around the headland. Pass cast through the windows of Ashunabidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibidibid
of somebody's house. It's in a it's in a particularly peculiar location, so it's whoa. Oh, you just weren't attacking for some reason. Oh, what have ye? Key. Scam skin. Worth money, so I might as well take it. An iron short sword. So, I would assume that having a hut in such a strange location, a town, it was ended up not being a particularly smart idea, all things considered. What a mess. Robe, shoes, and a key of some sort. Ah, the same key that the scamp had. of the spirit. I don't think I've read this one, and it's kind of short, so let's give it a go. The ancestors are among us. They are never farther away than the waiting door. The ancestors are not departed. The dead are not under the earth. Their spirits are in the restless wind in them. I have read this before. Out loud like this as well. Okay. Just kind of leave it there. And you know what? 